Hello everybody and welcome back to the Mega Modded. Nope, that's the different series. That's uh, Isaac and Gungeon. But anyways, this is kind of Mega Modded. I've not really been calling that, but it kind of is. Everything we play is Mega Modded. Anyways, we are jumping in as Brew. I'm skipping Rogue because I don't want to play a Rogue. <laughs> I'll be honest, I just don't want to play a Rogue. Uh, we're playing as uh, Brute here, which Brute is, is pretty, pretty great. Brute's pretty great. We still get to go with our mutation gun, which I realize we're kind of overplaying a little bit now. It's a little bit strong for what we're uh, what we're getting, but I don't know. I uh, I think it's still a, a very fun weapon to uh, try and utilize and mess around with uh, once we get a few mutations for it. Of course, this guy, he's a bit slower, but we get that punch. I think the punch restores a bit of HP as well. This might be the uh, legitimate worst first stage I've ever been on. I got like no rads at all from that. That might be my fault for missing out on some stuff there. But as you can see, you can heal up quite quickly with this guy through punches. It's kind of lovely. I think I think this character is really fun because it just it allows you to be supremely aggressive, which I think is just very very fun. <laughs> I probably shouldn't have punched that. Um, that barrel earlier, but you know what? It's fine. Um, fire plus supreme force is interesting. Um, shot splinter on pierce. Wait, shot splinter on pierce. Well, do they, do they already pierce? I'll take it anyways. What, what the hell? I'll take it anyways. Okay, no, it works. It works. Boom. Boom. I like the punches. Punch. Punch. I don't know how punching the boss will work, but I'm gonna try it. It's, it's just a really fun way to move around as this character as well. Because you get to like dive so quickly. There you go, did a, did a very good job actually. And we don't need to use any other guns too, which is just amusing to me. Anyways, yeah, I'm, full, I'm glad to be back on Nuclear Throne. I haven't played it in a little bit, actually, so it's uh, it's fun to be back on it. Not yet implemented. Okay, let's just go with Rhino Skin then. I think Rhino Skin, when we have such a such an easy ability to heal, is going to be fun. You may have hit me, but that means nothing to me. I am One Punch Man, I guess. I've never actually watched One Punch Man. I just know he's a bald kid that punches things. I feel like that's the uh, the most similar thing that we are. Oh my god, I should not have punched that barrel. That was a very bad idea. Is that a launcher? Oh, yes it is. The yeah, ADPD grenade launcher. Supremely satisfying to use. Where you at? Boom! Boom. I can do like a super charged up punch. I don't know what the super charged up punch does, I'll be honest. Cool, we're through. I just wanted to go here for the um, security blast. For the health more than anything, I'll be honest. I know that I've got easy ways of gaining health in this area. Didn't actually want to do this. I'll, I'll definitely tell you that for, for nothing. This was not my plan. But I guess the world had different plans for me. So here we are. But we do get cool guy. Hey, it's cool guy. It's cool guy. Please tell me that people have actually gone and uh, searched that on YouTube. Also, our frame rate is mega low in this area right now for some reason. I don't know what's causing it, but it's not good. I mean, our movement speed is definitely making it feel lower. But it does feel pretty low just generally. Got ya. No, thank you. Uh, did you manage to slip away down there? You did, didn't you? You dastardly fool. Goodbye, rats. Oh, what? They survived that? I'm surprised the cars didn't blow up immediately. Well, that was good. Oh, you survived. Yeah, you need to get gone. This is a... Very fun way to play a character. I just gotta say. Oh god. Just just fire the grenades very close range. 
worry about everything later on. I, I tried to charge up the punch, but the lag's making it hard. I think I opened up this machine. Infinite ammo for a short time. Let's go. Just, just get a few of these out there while we've got infinite ammo. I don't think that actually helped at all, but there you go. This should kill these guys pretty quick, though. Like, these grenades are not weak. Come on, fella. Oh, God, the slow movement speed of this dude is killing me. Okay, so that was just all sorts of major issues. Main one being, god damn, the FPS lowered, like, to a crawl in that floor for some reason, and it just destroyed me. I thought I'd be able to kill them still, but apparently not. Get that missing link, bad boys. Why are we getting so many fair stages that don't level us up as well? What's all that about? But yeah, this is probably one of my favorite modded characters. I really like the guy with flight as well, but that's more so just because the flight's really useful than his actual character gimmick. It's got that static electricity thing going on, which is kind of cool, but I'm, I'm more so just all about that, uh, that flight, I'll be honest. Okay, good. Uh, we do get the electric shots. That's pretty good. Additional bounces is also nice. Let's go for the electricity shot. Build this up a little bit. Because the thing is, we for the first few stages, we really have no reason to actually go out of our way to... Oh, uh, wait. I think when I fully charge it... and oh no, I, I do dash. I, I don't know what that was about then. Um, I just didn't dash on one of my punches then. Maybe it does more damage on a full charger. I'm really not sure. I see you there, invisible guy. You think you can get away from me? You think you can escape me? That was close. These things do so much contact damage. Apparently, as does the boss. And I keep mistiming my bloody dashes. There you go. There's so many enemies down here, so what the hell? Look at the damage. Yeah, we don't really need to use ammo or anything early on, so we can take whatever mutations we want, really. Ooh, toxic shots, clouds move towards enemies. I've got to try that out. Electric toxic shots. Okay, let's not use it down here, though. You need to go straight away, sir. Oh, God. Oh, God. This is bad. I need to use the uh, opportunity of these smaller enemies to heal up because I just took a lot of really dumb and bad damage. Okay, we're out to full now. The weapon we've currently got isn't very good either. I, mean, I suppose this thing isn't terrible, but it's not great either. Right. Power. Oh, hello. Didn't expect to get hit by one of you. Okay, I'm very scared of the uh, of the big dude because he can just one shot me. I think he does take damage to poison. I'm not sure. Okay, that actually worked extremely well. Like, way better than I thought it would. Faster explosive shots. This seems like it could only go poorly, but... We have made an incredible missing link right here, though. I will say that. Like, it's electric, explosive, and toxic. It's just, like, all the best things. Now, now all we need is toxic immunity. Then we'll be sitting pretty. Because at the minute, toxic could kill us very, very quickly, and it probably will kill us very, very quickly. It has been known to do so. God damn, this guy's slow movement speed is throwing me off so much. It feels like my game's, like, lagging really bad. Because, like, normally characters kind of all have the same movement speed, apart from fish being faster. The toxic does so much damage. It's kind of insane. I love this. We don't need to use much ammo on it, too. It can be pretty, uh, static. Just make sure we don't accidentally get split shot with toxic, because that's that, that killed us last time, didn't it? I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure it was that that killed us last time. 
Okay, let's let's be cautious here. No need to put ourselves in harm's way. Poison swirls do last a little longer than you expect, remember, as well. Yet another thing that's uh, foiled us before. That was <laughs> so much damage on that thing. Like, we don't even need to hit the enemies and the poison kind of gets them most of the time here. Give me all that. Oh, shit. Did not see you there. That would not have been good. Pizza cutter, plasmite pistol. Didn't really get much great from that, did we? Nail gun. Eh. All kind of so so. Right, we'll see what we can get out of this stage. Good, good. Just be very aware of where the poison is. It does move towards enemies, but if there isn't enemies for it to move towards, it kind of does some funky stuff. But it is pretty beautiful. Yeah, this is going to do supreme damage to this guy. There you go. Look at that. Beautiful damage. Opened up the portal and everything for us. It took a weapon through with it. Um, We don't want it to bounce, really. I think we go with uh, the smaller hitbox. I think that should help with the poison, actually. I think that could be pretty interesting. Okay, this is an area that bothers me a bit. That poison... That was close. Oh, there was a bit of poison there. God damn it. That did not kill anything. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Really bad things could happen right now. <laughs> that was lots of mistakes very quickly there. There was a tiny, tiny, like, speck of poison that got me. Right, let's just hope for the best here. We need that flame flacker. This is an extra weapon to do some good for us. Flame weapons are always good. We, we know this. We take those. We've also got a heart in the mix as well, which is scary. Yep. On this floor, it's very scary. Basically, because the hand duplicator things, the little hearts or whatever you want to call them, we're definitely dead on this stage, aren't we? Like, I'd, I'd like to be hopeful, but I'm not. Okay, we did get quite a lot of HP just then. We do have this weapon to spread some fear. Look at the poison. Why does that have to bounce like it does? It's so weird. It's peculiar, and I don't like it. Okay, health, health. I heard you, Mimic. Why did he follow me? I know that you're enemies and you want to kill me, but, like, could you not for a minute, please? Okay, nice. All of those die in pretty much a single hit. Oh, God. You got a nice little hit on me there. I'll, I'll give you that one. You're gonna drop me health. No. That's not health. Only a few fellas left. We're leaving this floor with not great health. What's what's this? Seems interesting. I'll take it. Um. Choice. Seeker shots. Projectiles. Flak. We do not want that. Shots create lightning. We already have that. Chance to refund rads. Flaming shots. Shots create lightning. Um, additional bounces and more powerful shots. Let's go with more powerful shots. That dude almost killed me.
I did actually get some health from that dude then. Yeah, this is scary as all hell. Yep, because I keep throwing poison at myself. Why does the poison have to bounce off of walls? What logic inspired that design? It makes no sense. Gimme, gimme, gimme. There you go. Maximum HP again. Oh my god. This is just difficult. Ev oh, everything about this is difficult right now. Okay, we did manage to kill the big boy. There's a weapons crate up here too, which is always good. That hit me. I don't know how, but it did. We got the Electroplasmic Rifle. Energy Spear. I don't think them two are going to cut it. This is a weird run. Please give me poison immunity. Yes, it did. No way. That, it basically, it doesn't get rid of our biggest hazard, but it at least makes it not as problematic. We could still very easily die to anything, but we can at least play a little more loosey-goosey now. I don't know how, like, how our rad efficiency is doing right now. Like, is this holding us from leveling up? I don't actually know. I'm going to pretend it's not. God damn. Ooh, IDPD heavy gun. Hell yes. This thing's actually nuts. With the heavy gun, with the uh, faster bullet velocity and explosives, I think we can probably use this a little bit to try and level ourselves up. Oh, I didn't realize we opened the throne vault. Nice. I suppose we did kill a lot of enemies down that little pathway then. That was uh, kind of nuts, wasn't it? Right. Can we unlock the character? We've been trying for literally years. Can it be done? Probably not, because when will we ever unlock this guy? I'll help you find it, I guess. I do want an extra mute. I'm going for it. It's risky, but I'm going for it. Unfortunately, none of these are any good. Although, Insurgency can be pretty good. I'll take Insurgency. I'm pretty happy about it. Any health for me, anybody? I realized that I could punch these enemies, but they've gotten to the point now where their health is quite high, and I don't think a single punch will always kill them. Oh, fuck. I forgot about this guy. This guy wrecks my shit every time. We did kill him pretty fast, though. Maxman rifle. Maxman rifle seems decent. I like the idea. The heavy assault rifle as well is also good. Yeah, let's go with the heavy assault rifle. This thing sounds meaty. Ooh, ho, 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 ho. yes, it is meaty. We got an insurgency down here as well. There you go. Beautiful. This is an interesting build we got going on right now. Still only level six though. We've been using a lot of our reds. Just in situations like this, like there's so many enemies, I want to use my I want to use my uh, poison gun. Oh, also we are kind of running out of ammo. Yeah, we can't. We kind of have to use this thing now. The Abbey's launch is down there. The volcanic sphere. Sphere? Spear. You know what I meant. Insurgency in this area is kind of funny. Seeing all the uh, the normal dudes about. 
And Sergeant is just in general a really fun idea for a mutation, I think. Excuse me. You touched me and I did not give you permission at all. Very rude. Right. Where on earth is that last boy? Okay, we've got a few more up here. Quite a few more up here, actually. Hey, look, we got ourselves a fella. Thank you. You helped me out. Up to level 7, finally. We've already got, um, like, immunity, so I actually don't think that's that important. Although we could get more maximum HP. Let's go for it anyways, because we could get more maximum HP. Take out these guys. Get all of that going. Okay, we've got to use this. Oh, do you see that dodge then? That was a very accidental. Oh, another one. And another one. Wow. I'm getting lucky with some of these dodges right now. Big dog. Big dog. This might be us dead here. Okay, that was close. That guy was coming at me fast. We did get the soda popper. I gotta say, I, th I thought there'd be a few more humans about. We didn't, unfortunately, get any additional HP out of this. Which is a shame. That's kind of what we're looking for. But we probably got some, like, accuracy and things like that. Then They're also important. Okay, we've got Cube Boy. Burning our way through some of these rads here, but it's a necessity. There's a lot of cute boys, actually. No, don't normally see many of these guys. They're an interesting enemy type. Okay, nice. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. did we just get the Plasma Bounce Cannon? Hell yes. This thing is uh, kind of risky, but also brilliant in every way. Not enough rads. We leveled up. There you go. Look at that bad boy. Look at it go. Additional bounce. Bounces are just bad. We can't be bouncing with with the setup we've got right now. Right. Is there anything else we really want out of this? Pounder. The flame flacker. The sniper rifle. The Zap Jaw. The Evolver Rifle. The Ion Cannon Mark II. Whoa. <laughs> now, nah, that's cool, but the pl we know the Plasma Bounce is the shit. We know this thing can really rip it up. Let's push forward, baby. Haha, <laughs> that worked. I was wondering if that would work. Yeah, Plasma Bounce does some, uh, does some nasty pasty stuff. Go, go, go. Three, two, one. Fire! Ow, I did get hit there. This is getting a bit nuts. Thank God everything died there, because I was really on the edge. I was really on the edge of thinking I might die there. <laughs> Ooh, um... Steel Nerves is, is probably pretty good. I don't know how quickly this will kill this dude. I doubt it'll be super quick, so I've got to be kind of cautious about how I use my ammo here. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, that actually was pretty good. 
That was pretty good. I don't even I didn't even get to see what that was. It looked interesting. Crystal can shield. Oh wow. Laser rifle bazooka. Oh, we got a tank. Oh, I might die immediately here. <laughs> oh my god, I did. <laughs> oh no. Anyways, that was a really fun episode. We managed to loop. Sadly, I didn't get to see my ultra. I would have loved to have seen the ultras in this character. I think I already have, but I don't remember them. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this one nonetheless, and I'll see you guys in the next one.